What is an algorithm and what are they actually used for? An algorithm is a set of instructions or rules that a computer or system follows to perform a specific task or solve a problem. Algorithms are used in a wide range of applications, some examples of these are Search engines, algorithms are used to determine the relevance and ranking of search results, based on factors such as keywords, user location, and search history. Social media, algorithms are used to show users the most relevant content, such as posts and videos, based on their interests and interactions. Data analysis, algorithms are used to process, analyze and extract insights from large data sets. Of course there are many, many more, but to give you a better example. In terms of YouTube, algorithms are used to determine which videos are recommended to users based on their viewing history, search history, and other data. The algorithm takes into account factors such as the number of views, likes, comments, and overall engagement to determine which videos are most relevant and interesting to the user. Additionally, the algorithm also takes into account the time of the video and the uploader of the video to show more recent video. Algorithm uses machine learning techniques to predict which videos a user is most likely to watch and engage with, and it continuously learns and adapts based on user behavior. While algorithms can have many positive benefits, there are also some potential downsides to their use such as Bias Algorithms can perpetuate and amplify biases present in the data they are trained on, leading to unfair or discriminatory outcomes. For example, facial recognition algorithms have been found to be less accurate for people with darker skin tones. There can also be a lack of transparency. It can be difficult for users to understand how an algorithm is making decisions and what factors are being taken into account. This can make it hard for users to trust the results or hold the algorithm accountable for any negative outcomes. It's important to note that most of these downsides can be mitigated by using transparent, explainable and fair algorithms, and by using them in conjunction with human oversight, monitoring and regulation. Hopefully this gives you a better understanding of what algorithms are and how they work. For more content like please like the video and subscribe to our channel.